distinguished platform guests, ladies and gentlemen, and especially Congressman Kennedy, who is attending on behalf of the Kennedy family and his cousin, Caroline Kennedy, our ship sponsor. It is my privilege and great honor to welcome you to the keel laying ceremony for the aircraft carrier John F. Kennedy, CBN 79. that our military service men and women who will serve aboard this vessel will always be able to stand on this flight deck and proudly say we're part of the greatest nation on this earth. Just like the carrier's namesake, President John F. Kennedy, we want this carrier to be a symbol of peace, equality, and power. Our quest for excellence was evident in 1964 when we laid the keel for the first JFK CB-67, and it holds true today. This aircraft carrier, CBN-79, will continue our tradition of always good ships. Congressman Kennedy, we are honored to build this ship to advance the legacy of President Kennedy and the legacy of service by the entire Kennedy family. We know CBN-79 will stand for strength, steadfastness, and courage as it sails the world, protecting our nation for generations. This is historic. No other state can talk about it, and no other nation around the globe can talk about the military naval power that the United States of America has. John F. Kennedy was an inspiration to all of us, youth, integrity, and vision. So it is only fitting today that we now have a U.S. president who now will have two aircraft carriers named after him. The ships built here, they are our nation's great instrument of security and two, of goodwill. So let this great purpose serve as a constant reminder, as inspiration to you, the men and women of Newport News Shipbuilding, that shipbuilding is not just what you do, it is who you are. And that building great ships, it is not just your tradition, it is your duty. It is not often I think you see a member of Congress with a, a bit of a loss for words, but this is not a, a typical day for me. To the workers who will toil away in this project and have already begun and will continue for the next seven years or so, I don't know what else to say other than an awe-inspired thank you. Uh, this is an extraordinary thing to be a part of. It's an extraordinary honor you bestow upon my family, and it is an extraordinary testament to your dedication and talents, uh, which you will build. And today, as we lay the keel for the CVN 79, she will carry with her President Kennedy's love, respect, and admiration for our country and our oceans. And with the initials CBK, those of my cousin Caroline Kennedy, she will also carry his love for family. As a young girl, my cousin Caroline christened the first USS John F. Kennedy, on her second try, actually. <laughs> and today, her initials are welded to the keel. She adds her own mark to the story of this ship. Please join me in welcoming Ambassador Caroline Kennedy. It's my honor to be the sponsor for the latest aircraft carrier, John F. Kennedy. My father displayed a spirit that challenged people to do more for their country and reach for that next level. I hope that all those who sail on this ship will sail with the same sense of service to our nation that my father felt. It's my honor to be allowed to authenticate the keel laying by providing my initials on this plate, which I do now. This will be present with you in Virginia and will be affixed to the ship during construction. Now, the moment you've been waiting for. Please join me in welcoming our welder, Mr. Leon Walston. I 
I hereby declare the keel of this United States ship, John F. Kennedy, truly and fairly laid. Move this keel unit into the dry dock. Get going. Copy that, Emily.